Avalon is a contraction of my name and an honor to my dad after he died in a car accident. And he's been with me um, since I started my career as a creative artist. I started to make candles for my wedding and uh, everyone uh, started asking me if I could do some more. So I started selling them in local markets, in small stalls, in local communities and it was a total success. It was getting so busy that I had to stop my part-time job and decided to go full-time job in what it was in the beginning, a small dream. Even though it's a very hard job to go every day and work with your hands, sometimes uh, with materials that are cold, uh, you are always wet or dirty. It's, for me, it's, um, it's a blessing. It's, controlling my own time, uh, having my dog with me every day, it's actually my dream come true. This is the way I know the porcelain is not cracked and it's an entire vitrified porcelain shade in this case. This is going to be a lamp and if I show it to you, you can actually see my hands through it without even the light coming. My inspiration can come from a small tiny stone with an amazing shape on the beach to a huge sculpture like the David of Michelangelo. My work starts when I dream, although my aesthetic isn't like Dali's realism 
or the honorism of Chagas is more eclectic. My first drawing class was in a computer. I learned to use vectors to make digital brushes, but this is not affecting the fact that I love nature and I care for it. I like to understand how earth is transformed into ceramic. It's magical. I chose to make a candle because it was a way of representing love and it, for me to see uh, the blink of the flame is like a heartbeat. It's alive, it's burning and one day it will be extinct. So it is life and it is love.